welcome to True Worshippers Evangelistic Center Morning Devotion. We thank God for the privilege of another day on this earth to continue to fulfill the plans and purpose He has for our lives. We thank God for protecting us through the night and for waking us up to a brand new day. We thank God for providing for all our needs. We thank God that we are in the land of the living, so we will create a beautiful day for ourselves and others despite the challenges that each day may bring. Today's morning devotion focuses on planning a trip. The borders are open, so where will you be going? Are you planning an earthly or a heavenly trip? We are all passengers and God is our travel agent who already fixed all our routes, reservations and destinations. So trust him and enjoy the trip called life. At this time, we are all uncertain about traveling to another country. We are uncertain about our travel plans. So just as you cannot wait to travel or you are uncertain about whether you should travel or not, have you thought about your heavenly trip? Matthew 25, 14 says, For the kingdom of heaven is as a man traveling into a far country who called his own servants and delivered unto them his goods. The earthly borders are opening up, however, there is no additional requirements to travel abroad because of COVID-19. Vaccination and PCR tests. Unlike the earthly borders, heaven's border never closes. It is always open, awaiting the next arriving soul. However, just like the earthly requirements to travel from one country to another, Heaven has its traveling requirements also. Your ticket must be stamped. I gave my life to Jesus. Without that ticket stamped, saved through the blood of Jesus, you do not have a chance to enter heaven. John 3, 1-5 describes it best. There was a man of the Pharisees named Nicodemus, a ruler of the Jews, the same came to Jesus by night and said unto him, Rabbi, we know that thou art a teacher come from God, for no man can do these miracles that thou doest, except God be with him. Jesus answered and said unto him, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, except a man be born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. Nicodemus said, unto him, How can a man be born when he is old? Can he enter the second time into his mother's womb and be born? Jesus answered, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, Except a man be born of water and the Spirit, he cannot enter into the kingdom of God. So I encourage you to ensure that your heavenly travel plans are in order just as your earthly travel plans. Check your heavenly ticket and ensure that it is stamped with the blood of Jesus. I encourage you to make a decision to accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior. It is the best decision you could ever make in your life. As you step into each new day, leave footprints of love, joy, peace, kindness, comfort, and hope. And remember, don't miss the heavenly flight. Check your ticket, ensure it is stamped with the blood of Jesus. God bless you. Jesus loves you. Shalom.